English 011 Listening Unit 5 Anthropology Unit 5 Anthropology Objectives By the end of Unit 5 you'll be able to Define the word anthropology Identify the main ideas from an interview with an anthropologist and describe the field of anthropology in its different areas of study. Listening skills. Let's look at the meaning of anthropology. Anthropology is the scientific study of humans, past and present, that draws and builds upon knowledge from the social sciences and life sciences, as well as the humanities. Unit 5, Listening Track. An interview with an anthropologist. If you want to listen to this track right away, please click this link that I just highlighted. Listening skill. Read the statements above. Then listen to the interview by clicking on this link or an audio file attached above. After you listen, check the four main ideas presented in the interview in the discussion forum. We will now begin by listening to the interview. We're continuing our series on career options today. Each week, I've been asking people from different professions to describe their field or job a little. Today, I'm talking to Dr. Julian Tate, an anthropologist. Dr. Tate, I'm wondering if we can begin with an explanation or definition of anthropology. I'm not sure everyone knows exactly what it is. Well, I'm not sure I know. Uh, don't worry, this is a question I'm asked a lot. Basically, anthropology is the study of humans, and uh, that means humans now, in the present, or at any time in the past. So really, it's a pretty broad field. I'll say that does seem broad. Yes, but the field is typically divided into four different areas of study. Uh, one is cultural anthropology. This is a study of ways of life, traditions, customs, etc., of different groups of people. I think that's probably what I imagined anthropology to be about. Yes, but as I mentioned, there are other areas. There is also physical or biological anthropology, which looks at human origins, genetics, and biological variation. Then another area is archaeology. Oh, archaeology is considered part of anthropology? Yes, it generally is. It's the study of humans in the past. So, well, if you think of it that way, you can see how it would fit in. Yes, I see. And what's the last area of focus? That's linguistic anthropology. As you can probably guess, this area focuses on language and, uh, of course, the relationship between language and culture. Hmm. So there really is quite a lot of range in there. Yes, there is. And what's your area of specialty? Well, I started out in cultural anthropology a long time ago, but then I actually moved into another subcategory in, in anthropology, music. I study early music in North America. Oh, really? Music is part of anthropology, too? Yes, if you think about it, music can be uh, an important part of people's everyday life, and it can be very much related to their culture. I actually think that the field of anthropology will continue to broaden and expand. Human life is so rich and varied that it seems logical that there will be more subcategories of study. Okay. Now, if one or more of our listeners think they might be interested in anthropology, what do you suggest they do? Well, my suggestion would be to check at the local college or university and see if they have an anthropology program and uh, see what the required classes are. As with any field of study, it's a good idea to take an introductory course to find out if you really are interested in the field. So I'd suggest that. Then I'd also suggest talking to anyone you can find who's in anthropology. And last question, can you make a good living in anthropology? <laughs> good question. It depends on your specialty and what kind of job you get, but it's pretty unlikely that you'll get rich. However, it's a fascinating field, so that's why I'd recommend it. It's always interesting. Okay, now let's look at the four main ideas presented in the interview. The first main idea. Anthropology is the study of humans now or at any time in the past. The second main idea. The field of anthropology is generally divided into four areas. The third main idea. Dr. Tate suggests taking an introductory course 
and talking to people to find out about the field. And the last main idea. Dr. Tate says an anthropologist is unlike to take a rich, but that it's a fascinating field. Now, I want you to listen to the interview again. After you listen, answer the following questions. Please pause your screen and listen to the interview again. Okay, number one, define the word anthropology. It is the scientific study of humans, past and present, that draws and builds upon knowledge from the social sciences and life sciences, as well as the humanities. Number two, what is studied in cultural anthropology? The ways of life, traditions, and customs of different people. Number three, what is studied in physical or biological anthropology? People in the past. Number four, what is studied in archaeology? Human, origi <clears throat> human origins, genetics, and biological variation. Number five, what is studied in linguistic anthropology? Language and relationship between language and culture. Number six, what does he think will happen in the field in the future? He thinks there will be more subfields of study. Listen to the interview again, pause your screen, and then write a blog describing the field of anthropology and its different areas of study.